All right, so it's our off day today. Um, we're just chilling in the Hazen car park for now. This is this is Sam. He's uh he's from England. I don't know. I'm not sure if I've introduced you yet. Europe. <laughs> But England, France, and Portugal. He's on. He's on. Yeah, he's quite an eclectic mix. We are. Uh, so it's our day off today. So we're just waiting for Nick to come, and then he's going to drive us over to his place. So we're going to drop in some washing. He lives in Madison, Connecticut. And then I think we're just going to kind of chill out today. We're going to go to the shops, the Nike shop. Yeah. Um, so start the deals. Get some deals. Get some good shoes. Get some good clothes. Maybe. We'll see. We can keep it fresh. Keep it real. Yep. And then uh, later we're doing a. Uh, what are we doing? It's a kind of a dinner thing with some of the girls from camp. Yep, cook a meal, nice um, composed meal, vegetarian meats and Portuguese dessert. Yeah, it's gonna be a good good night, I think. Good day. It's gonna be nice and relaxed, nice yeah. and chilled. So um, like I haven't done a lot of vlogging on my days off just because I couldn't be bothered. So today I'll try and get some more footage just to show you what Connecticut's like and Madison and wherever we go. I think we might be going to New Haven later, but. I don't know. Well, there's talk about us going to New Haven. Um, I think it's more Vince who's keen to go to New Haven. Last time we went, we weren't able to stop because it's the fourth most dangerous um, city in um, America, believe it or not, New Haven. None of us know about this place and back in the Europe place. Yeah, I know. In, in an intense way. Anyhow, so we might be going over there, we might not. And we also want to know... What do we want to know? winning national lottery tickets for the American National Lottery. Is that what we want to know? Always. Well, we'll find out then, won't we? All right, so we I'll... Um, it is our mission. So we'll get some footage. I'll, I'll show you next place, and then I'll show you some other places we go. Peace. Cool. There you go. All right, so we're in Madison right now with uh, Sam and Vince, and we're just chilling. Hey. What? What up? There's Sam. Um, Nick's at the gym. We're just kind of chilling. Just Buying. Things, buying stuff, necessities, buy all, uh, pharmaceutical uh, products. Um, and so I'm just kind of checking out the stores, just kind of walking around. Preventativo. <laughs> and then later we're gonna go get some food for tonight. Um, are we going to that Nike store? Yeah. 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 Go to the Nike store. Um, various other things. But yeah. So this is Madison, Connecticut. Um, it's very pretty, I guess. <laughs> I don't know if this is defined as pretty. Nick's always been saying, this town is cool, this town is not, this town is cool, this town is like... Me and Sam were saying, can we tell the difference? They all look the same. They look the same as the people. Yeah, I guess they do. So yeah, um, that's what's going on. Hey, so I'm at uh, Nick's place at the moment. Sam and Vince have gone to the shops to get some food for tonight. Um, this is Nick's place behind me. He lives in Madison, Connecticut. Um, apparently it's a pretty uh, patriotic town because it's really old. And so there's a lot of like this stuff up and around, like red, white and blue. It's pretty incredible actually. But um, it's a nice place. It's quite uh, rural out here, but I like it. Um, so we're just chilling at the moment, getting food ready. We're going to have a bit of a dinner thing tonight with some of the the girls from uh, camp and yeah that's what we're doing at the moment. Hey so uh, it's my third week here it's the second session of the summer so it's the second lot of kids that are coming in. Um, these kids I've been with for a week and a bit already they come on a Sunday and they leave on a Friday so it's, uh, it's uh, a Tuesday today so they're here for another couple days and um, I've been in cabin number two which is directly behind me um, that means I've had kids that are aged from about 9 up to 11. Um, I last, last session, the first session, so two, week, two weeks ago, we had six boys with us for the week. Uh, this time we've got eight, so it's me and another counsellor, and then we have eight boys sleeping with us um, in the cabin. Behind me, we've got a pretty good position because behind me is the, uh, the uh, soccer pitch, and across there is a the basketball, and then over there behind me is a dining hall somewhere. I can't really see, it's pretty sunny. But yeah, we're right here. Yeah. Right there. The, we take, um, just to give you an idea, we take showers just behind me. In that building behind me, I don't know if you can see it. But yeah, that's what's happening. It's been pretty good, the kids have been pretty awesome. Yeah, the reason I can't film at camp is because um, I can't put any footage of kids that I get 
up on the net because for like privacy reasons and stuff. But I'll try and get some more footage um, later on this week. Okay, bye.